Tesla made a huge splash when it introduced the world to its all-electric heavy truck, the Tesla Semi. As electric semi-trucks await their mainstream debut, and as Rivian gets ready to arrive at your doorstep with your Amazon Impulse buys, there is yet another electric delivery truck maker that hasn't gotten as much attention as Tesla, Arrival or Daimler. London-based Volta Trucks, founded in 2019, is currently on a European tour with its own entry into the last mile delivery business, showcasing its 16-ton electric truck. Dubbed the Volta Zero, this electric truck is a bit larger than the prototypes we've seen from Rivian, for example, and it also has a higher payload capacity of 18,960 pounds. As for the design, Volta Zero sports sculptural surfaces and a pure lines, with an obvious focus on aerodynamics. The bullet-like shape, rear wheel covers, air curtains, and large rear diffuser make it glide easily through air contributing to less energy use and increasing the Volta Zero real-world range. The truck aims to be green in more than just its powertrain. The body of the truck is made from carbon-neutral flex fiber, while the batteries are composed of lithium-iron phosphates, so they do not rely on rare earth metals like other types of EV batteries. The design of the truck itself was not adapted from a diesel engine truck type, instead is a clean sheet design with a low, central seating area for the driver, tall, plexiglass windows for better visibility, planetary doors that swing open in a parallel manner, and a low entry floor for the cargo compartment as well. Instead of mirrors, the truck relies on the 360-degree cameras positioned on the A pillars inside the cabin giving it a little extra room on the outside to maneuver in traffic. It's expected to provide a range of 95 to 125 miles and can carry an 8,600 kg payload. The production vehicle will feature a cargo box design, but the prototype uses a flatbed to allow engineers to add different levels and locations of loads to test its weight-carrying capacity. The Volta Zero will eliminate an estimated 1.2 million tons of CO2 by 2025. Is the self-driving truck this century's flying car, or is it a true technological breakthrough that will transform the lives of drivers and the operations of fleets that employ them? Tough question, and the answer depends on who you ask. Lawyers and legislators will certainly have a say in the future of self-driving trucks and other vehicles on our roadways. But when it comes to the technology of self-driving trucks, we pretty much have the answer already. With its seamless ability to move cargo, Tesla's semi-truck has proved it is actually capable of doing what it was created for, and carrying large objects in a zero-emissions truck turns out to be a treat for the entire EV community. The Tesla Semi has autopilot and other advanced safety features, but it stops short of being truly autonomous it will still have the ability to platoon with other Tesla trucks, creating a kind of highway train of semis driving close together, which could ultimately benefit consumers and the environment, he said, and make the road safer. The Tesla Semi was shown as a Class 8 day cap model with four independent electric motors, one for each of the four rear wheels. Volvo's self-driving semi-truck much is said about the emergence of autonomous cars on our streets, but enclosed areas like ports, factories, and corporate campuses may well be where they are put to work first. With this in mind, Volvo has just announced a new electric vehicle concept built to tow loads around these kinds of environments all on their lonesome. So much so it hasn't even bothered with a cabin. The Volvo Vera concept is designed to lighten the load around ports, factories, logistics centers, and anywhere else where goods are moved on the regular. Powered by the same drivetrain and battery packs as Volvo's electric trucks, the Vera is built to carry out repetitive, short-distance trips with large, heavy loads. T-Log Truck 4x4 It might not be the quickest vehicle at the event, but the Swedish transport company Einride has chosen the Goodwood Festival of Speed to reveal the T-Log, an autonomous electric logging truck, incorporating some unusual purpose-built design for the niche logging market. The vehicle is designed to go off-road and to navigate forest roads with and without loads. 
the truck has no driver's cab for a human to enter and sit in. Instead, manual driving is conducted via remote control, which can happen from anywhere with the connection to the T-Log truck. The T-Log is remote controlled through a teleoperation system designed by Phantom Auto that can operate over 4G connections with minimal latency. The lack of a driver's cab in the T-Log means more room for cargo, lower production and maintenance costs, and lower operating costs. The system combines with NVIDIA's self-driving technologies, using cameras, LiDAR, and radar to form a 360-degree, real-time view of the T-Log's surroundings. The T-Log is a 16-ton truck that operates using 300 kWh onboard batteries for an expected range of 120 fully loaded miles, 193 kilometers per charge. Thor ET-1 the ET-1 is the first product from the company, and Zemmler hopes it will be the flagship model in a robust, customizable line that would also eventually include delivery vans and work vehicles. Like Musk's model, the ET-1 boasts a sleek, futuristic aesthetic, an all-electric motor that ditches dirty diesel fuel, and the ability to haul up to 80,000 pounds of cargo, something currently only the industry's highest class of trucks can tow. The Thor version also uses a 22-inch touchscreen on its dashboard, which communicates with the vehicle's electric motor and battery packs, which can carry the truck 300 miles on a charge. Thor is hoping to bring the ET-1 to market in 2021 at an estimated starting price of $150,000. Intelligent and driverless truck Cruzavicus If you'll take a look closer at the Cruzavicus, you'll notice that it has no doors or windows, and it doesn't need a driver, because it is the driver. Designed by Art Lebedev Studio, this freight-carrying semi-truck comes with an incredibly slim profile, and it's a driverless truck. It doesn't need a driver operating it, even remotely. The absence of a cockpit allows the Grusovicus to take a much more streamlined, aerodynamic front, with a single vertical screen that houses all of the truck's sensors and computers. The slimmer front allows the bed at the back to be longer, giving the truck much more stability as its front axle also bears an equal portion of the load. The Grusovicus still comes equipped with headlights and taillights that help the truck be visible to pedestrians and drivers around it, conforming to current transportation standards and naturally, it's all electric. Mercedes Euro X this minimalist truck named Mercedes Euro X was designed by Mu Yan Cho as an intermediary step between human-operated trucks and absolute autonomy. This difference is most obvious in the cabin. It falls somewhere in between the extreme minimalism of other driverless concepts and current designs. The Euro X cabin's pointed face cuts through the air to decrease resistance and improve mileage. You won't find any windows, but that doesn't mean nobody is on board. A cozy place for a driver has been relocated to the center and lower portion of the cabin, where they can monitor systems in between, kicking back and enjoying the ride.